Okay, we're gonna try the experiment. First thing let's do, let's get all the equipment out. So we've got a Coke bottle, beaker of baking soda, beaker of vinegar. We've got our graduated cylinder. We've got a test tube and a scoopula. So they're, they're here. And we have a weigh boat. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pour some vinegar into the graduated cylinder so I can get 10 ml. And it doesn't have to be perfect, but it should be close. Okay, so that's about 10. Now I've decided this time I am going to pour the vinegar into the bottle. And we're allowed to have paper towels too. I'm gonna to take a couple of paper towels. I'm gonna to make sure the bottle is super dry. Um, if there's moisture on the outside of the bottle, like if the last group didn't do a good job at um, wiping it down after they cleaned out the bottle, it'll have water on it. And if you touch it with gloves and then remove your hand, you'll pull water off and you'll get mass. Now, I am not gonna put the baking soda in here. I'm gonna use all my equipment. I'm gonna put the baking soda into the test tube. Now, in order to do that, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna use the weigh boat. So we'll turn it around. So you can see, I'm gonna turn on the balance. Let it go to zero, open it up, put the weigh boat on. I'm gonna zero it. And now I'm gonna add baking soda until I have a gram and a half. or very close to it. It should be within 0.01 grams. Okay, well, that's perfect. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pour that baking soda into my tube. Okay, so I got my baking soda in my tube. What am I gonna do next? I'm gonna take my Coke bottle and I'm gonna slide the tube in. Because guess what? Now I've got the baking soda inside, in the bottom, in the tube, and I've got vinegar in there, but it's not reacting. I'm gonna cap it super tight so no air leaks out and I'm gonna dry it one more time. So this is my system before reaction. Everything is together. Now I look at the balance, I gotta zero it, and I wanna find out how much it weighs before I shake it to cause the reaction to happen. So let's take a quick look. 44.53 grams. Okay. Now, let's move this off to the side. Now to cause the reaction, I need the baking soda to mix with the vinegar. So how do I do that? Shake like a maniac. The tube won't break. If you listen, you can hear sizzling. You see the baking soda is out of the tube. If you feel the bottle, it's gotten harder, all right? So let's turn this back on. Make sure it goes back to zero. And let's see how we did. 44.54. Okay, now you have to decide whether or not we're able to prove the law of conservation of mass, but we're not done yet. We've gotta put everything away. So we're gonna put everything back in the bin and we're gonna to have to clean out the bottle. We turn the balance off, everything goes back in, the paper towels be thrown away. If you made any mess, you wipe it up with the paper towels. So we're gonna take our bottle. Oh, you know what? Maybe I'll do one more thing quick. Let's put this back on. Just so you can see. I guess that the bottle feels like it's got gas in it. I'm gonna open it up, now listen. Did you hear something? Now, if gas has mass, now it should even weigh less. Let's see. 44.43, okay. That's actually interesting to know because what you've done is if you have a really good sealed system, no gas gets out and the mass will be the same. If you have a lousy system and you let the gas out, it won't be the same. So anyway, we gotta go over here to the sink. Gonna have to clean things out before we're done. So we turn on the water. Gonna rinse out the cap. 
Now we're gonna dry this stuff in a minute. I'm gonna catch the test tube so it doesn't hit the bottom of the sink and break. Rinse that out. And now I'm gonna wash out the bottle. I'm gonna do it at least three times. Because you don't wanna leave anything in there because somebody else is gonna come along next class. All right, and do this. Now, what you're supposed to do at this point is do your absolute best to get everything dry, okay? My gloves are wet, tube is wet, everything is wet. So we're gonna try to do our best to get everything dry. Now we will have to throw away all the paper towels, yes, I know that. So try to get it really dry. Okay, we'll set that off. I'm gonna dry the tube. It's the outside that matters, not the inside. You wanna make sure that the outside of the containers are dry. The inside doesn't really matter for the most part. So the outside is now dry. Oops, okay. And now I'm gonna dry the cap. So now I've been a good citizen. I've got it all put, you know, dried off on the outside. I'm gonna take this stuff back to the table. Okay, back to the bin. And I'll put everything in the test tube, the bottle, and the cap. And now we are done with the experiment.